I picture them to be one of the best and most well-preserved uh, natural wonders of the world, to be worthy of the UNESCO World Heritage you know, that was placed on us. And I hope that it will place a beacon of hope for the rest of their marine environments uh, to be a better and brighter place for our Earth's future. I guess it would be good for Palau. Mm -hmm. It'll be a way to sustain the reefs mm -hmm. and the fishes because mm -hmm. there's been a little decline in some species of fish. So I guess that would be good for us. I want to see more effort put into monitoring the reefs. Uh, Palau is such a small country and we need more manpower and more equipment to, to be able to watch over what we have. Matsuakal Masangal Mulla, a Matsuakal Masangal Sokal Mystery or other Dongra Alin Mo Plagar and Gil, a Sangal Mora Lok Malay, a Mom Sisi Il Enforcer, the Nizing Mal, Clothed Trelly, and Yabur Lin Mira Blue. I think uh, as, a, as being a youth, um, there's a lot planned for the future. And we can go, there's nowhere to go if we don't have anything for ourselves. So I think this is one way for us to keep who we are, uh, culture, uh, cultural practices, uh, and some of, uh, yeah, just, just a way to display uh, how we want to conserve, how we want to do better, and how we want to climb up the ladder. <laughs> Long so they start to look at it. Then that's the way that time of the Mral, my daughter, Tangi, Mral Mobia, Nigel. That's the way they afford the extra. Well, I hope our, I hope this bill gets passed uh, so that it can show, uh, show to the world that we care truly about our environment and our conservation efforts and show other places that they can follow us and be a beacon for clean and uh, clean natural wonders of the world.